Uh, basically, a few years ago, I was deemed, um, you know, ineligible for a driver's license uh, due to mental issues. So I basically drive a scooter because the smaller ones, you don't have to get registered and you don't have to have a driver's license. Usually I drive a scooter because it's a little bit cheaper on gas, it's a little bit more kind of kick back, it takes a little bit slower over time. My favorite part about riding scooters is probably the fact that it makes me smile. You know? It takes you out of the mundane, the vulgar, and the pedantic. The best part of scooter riding is that it's like a bicycle, but with an engine. Uh, basically, I spend you know two dollars and fifty cents on a gallon of gas, and it gets me around town for a week. So, of course, it also gets ninety miles to the gallon. No joke. Three dollars a week is killing me. You know? I really like the fact that I can get around campus and then trans transfer to the streets like directly. Like I don't have to like take the back route to just find like a big enough space to drive. The scooter can fit anywhere. Little guys, and you can go through the little back roads and go all the way to your destination safely. Don't go long distances because I went to Rio Rancho and it's just, it takes forever to get there and um, just go short distances, maybe like 20 miles away, tops. I've taken them to Santa Fe by way of Madrid and I've been to the top of the crest and I have friends who I am accustomed to dropping into in Berlin from time to time. A little traffic danger sometimes if you're out there in the afternoon and stuff like that, but otherwise it's pretty good. Technically, basically, you're, you're not in a, a cage or anything like that. It's just um, just all around you, the wind's blowing at you. If you hit one thing, then um, you're basically done. Um, actually, there was one time on the, the scooter that I had just bought, uh, the tire had busted on the freeway. With 10 inch tires, you go through some tires, you know? I got a flat tire in there because it's just old and worn out. Yes, I personally wear a helmet. I think it's a, a good idea because, you know, you gotta protect your cranium. I, I bought two helmets, one for the back seat driver, or the bike seat rider. It is a growing market because, well say you know in Vietnam, it's like their main form of transportation. In Europe there's a lot more scooter riding than there is here, so we're pretty behind in that sense of, I think it's a trend that we are taking up though, it's not something that, you know, we differentiate from, I think that it's just going to be constantly growing from now until Whenever. You're going down, you got your scarf flowing behind you, you know, you got your, your, your sunglasses on and your helmet, and I don't know, it just feels pretty cool. Best vehicle I've ever had in my life.